they're an up and down team. Um, we knew what to prepare for. Um, and we, we've been preparing for them all week. We've been playing a tough schedule to get ready for them. And, um, you know, we knew they were a good team. We knew they were going to make their run. We just had to wait for ours, and it came at the right time. You know, it's another overtime game with St. Ed's. I mean, it's becoming whole home. Uh, but yeah, that's where high school basketball should be played. I have to ask you, how was the poker face tonight with you guys? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, we, we just played some straight man-to-man. -man. Uh, Eric doubled a little more than I thought he would, but you know, hopefully, God willing, we, we get an opportunity to play again um, if everything goes well. But you know, it, it's going to be a great basketball game if, if we get a, a third opportunity. We still have a lot of time to prepare for them in the playoffs. I mean, that's, the playoff game is what counts. I mean, this is a great game to win, but I mean, the playoffs is what counts. I mean, it was it was crazy atmosphere. I mean, it doesn't get better than that overtime game. It's every year overtime at least. So I mean, it was great to just get that final win for our final senior year game against them. Looking back, the first game, was there any deja vu on that last play that they had to go the distance to tie? I mean, the, the way it just that stuff goes down, it's kind of ridiculous that it's like this in this rivalry. It's always down to the end, and it's going to be back and forth at the end until someone pulls away.